We'll start in the standing position. The first movement is forward and back bending. Take your legs hip width apart. Slowly bend your knees. Keeping the pelvic duct, slowly raise your hands. As you inhale, slightly bend backwards. Keep looking straight. As you exhale, bend forward. Let the belly touch the thighs. Keep the knees bent. Hands can go upwards from the back. Continue. Inhale up and slight back bend. Look straight. Exhale down, belly to thigh. You can repeat this process six to seven times. Start with legs hip width apart. As you inhale, raise your right hand up to the sky. As you exhale, bend from your waist to the left side. Make sure you keep looking straight and the chest keeps facing ahead. Inhale, come back to center. Take your left hand up. Exhale, bend to the right side. Continue this movement six to seven times. Keep alternating between right and left. Slowly come onto your knees and palms. Vyagra Shwasa, more commonly called as cat and camel stretch. Place your palms right below the shoulders. Place the knees slightly away from each other. As you inhale, arch your spine and look straight. As you exhale, round that spine and look towards your knees. Continue six to seven times. Keep the neck movements gentle. Lie down on your back and bend your knees towards your chest. Take your hands in a T, palms on the floor. Inhale in the center. As you exhale, slowly without touching your feet to the floor, take your knees towards the right arm. Make sure both the shoulders stay on the mat and don't lift off. Inhale, come back to the center. Exhale, both knees to the left arm. Continue this movement six to seven times. In all these movements, the breath is very important. Do not ignore the breath. Lying down on your back, knees bent close to the chest, hug your legs, hug your thighs. You can gently rock from side to side, giving your spine a little massage. The breathing can be natural, soft inhalations and longer exhalations. Stay here for five to six breaths and then slowly release your hands, release your legs. Roll over onto the side and come to a seated position whenever you're lifting off from a supine position. Thank you guys. Hope this helps. Stay home and stay safe. Namaste.